Mm. Hey Panchanitas, welcome back to another episode. Today we got a nice pair of pies here just to share with you. We have a great collab that we're doing with Meech Love Eats ASMR. Great channel. Love her stuff she does. She does straight ASMR. I'm going to leave the link in the description. I put pictures throughout the video. So make sure you go ahead and smash that like with us and then go check her out as well and let her know you're coming from Panchanitas. With that being said, Mrs. P, you want to say hello to everybody? Hi, everyone. Anna, you want to say hello to everybody? Hi. And Kobe's running around. So, what are we eating today? Uh, today, we decided to do the new Beyond Pan Pizza. This one. I'll yes. be honest, out of both of them, that one looks the tastiest. I really want to get into that. It has a plant-based Italian sausage topping with a taste that's beyond belief. I guess I could see the, the fact that it's going to taste beyond belief. Okay, and this one, what do we got over here? That one is double cheeseburger pizza. That has zesty burger sauce, beef, tomatoes, and dill pickles. That's a lot of veggies. So it, it says it's for a limited time only. So it and it says it's a comeback. So I guess it's so they had it at one point and they brought it back. Probably people love like it. We haven't tried it, so I'm excited to try it. So it's let's good. get in it. I'm hungry. Who wants a slice? I do. All right, from here. Let's see. Let's give them a nice little close up. Looks guys. like meat, but it's not meat, guys. There you go, Mrs. P. Oh, no, you want a slice? Oh. You want this one? Mm -hmm. From this one? Mm -hmm. What? Okay. Okay. Let's make sure we don't let nothing go down, because, you know. You guys, that guy know. Is, is a little puppy. He's eating his food. Little guy doesn't understand we're trying to record a video. No, I think he's joining because actually it's bringing up all the stuff. No, I took the bite out of this one. I did feel burger. It's good. You have the. It has a burger vibe to it. Mm hmm. I've been running around basically the whole day. I haven't, I've made only breakfast, so I'll use some space so I can make sure I make this video. What do we have here? Ranch. For all you ranch lovers. Next week, you guys, I'm having my molars removed. Hmm. On Thursday, I'm petrified. <laughs> okay, I'm petrified. But. Their parents are coming over to help us out mm -hmm. with the kids, me work. The good thing is that I heard I'll be drinking liquids for like a week. So that's a good little way well, to lose some weight. <laughs> and then I guess I should remove my molars as well. I need some help. All these videos I'm trying to do for you guys. I can feel them. If yeah, anyone has gotten their molars removed, let me know how it went in the comments below. Yeah, and what's the best thing she could do just uh, so she could suffer less? <laughs> I know you want to know. Tips will be appreciated. No, thank you. In the comments down below, put you'll be all right, Cecilia. <laughs> More support there. <laughs> So it's Sunday, Sunday evening. Well, at least when we're recording this video, mm -hmm. not when it's going out. You guys are just going to see this on Tuesday. But I feel like the weekend flew by so fast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Every mm -hmm. weekend. 
Yeah, the holidays are already around the corner. And so is my birthday. Mm -hmm. Yep. Ariana's birthday is December twenty first. December twenty first. She's turning thirteen. And I may or may not do um a video about my thirteenth birthday like vlogging. Surprise I'll see your eatle list. Did you try the vegan? Well, it's not all vegan because the cheese, I think, is just regular cheese, but... I'm going there now. It's pretty good. <laughs> Hold on. this video i think we're going back to my water i like my water yeah i'm not a fan of sprites i think it's because they drink it a lot as a kid mm -hmm. same with me but now my favorite is pineapple fanta fanta and coca-cola yeah i actually grew up drinking seven up i always thought they were the same as sprite but they're not mm. right hey wouldn't you guys like to drink you grew up drinking let us know. Leave it in the comments below. All right, let's try this. Ooh, look at that. Big bite. <laughs> Guys, I really want to know if this is just me that it happened or just something that happened to all of us that do ASMR. I was actually having a meeting with the rest of my peers. We ordered food and I felt like when I was chewing throughout the meeting, I could hear my sounds. And in my head, it's like, oh no, oh no. I knew it, my ASMR chewing was gonna follow me. <laughs> I felt like I was making noise and chewing. I felt like people were walking and staring at me. It was like, all right. So if this happens to you too, let me know. It tastes like sausage. Mm-hmm. Just so you guys know, I eat no of this, but I have some food on the way for me. <clears throat> so what's coming up? We got Thanksgiving. Christmas, Black Friday. Mm. Black Friday. I don't think Black Friday is going to be no more Black Friday like it used to be. Because everything's just done online. Right, I think we've done Black Friday shopping maybe twice in a lifetime. And that's it. I always feel like Cyber Monday usually has like the same deals. Alright, are you guys going to go Black Friday shopping? Let us know. I think Cyber Monday is just them trying to make you buy the stuff that you didn't want to go buy on Black Friday. Like so Ariana's uh, car? Mm -hmm. You want to tell them? Yeah, let's get a little story time. <laughs> story time. <laughs> so, what, three, four years ago? No, Mom? Ariana's 13. When Ariana was like maybe four or three, there was this um, Barbie motorized car that she wanted. And of course. The big ones that the kids get in. Yeah, the ones that you can get in and they can drive it. Um, and we noticed that Toys R Us had them on sale for Black Friday. Like a hundred bucks under the regular price. So we decided, okay, we're gonna go and we're gonna camp out. We actually arrived to Toys R Us like six hours before they opened. And it was me, Mr. P, and I think both his sisters, right? It was just the four of us. Yeah. Just the four of us. And we, we brought chairs and we literally camped out there for about six hours. We were technically, we were like the fourth in line, like the fourth group in line. But then as soon as it hit, I think like five minutes before the store opened, literally people just like people got on the front. line were people, making line for people other than them. Yeah. They, they came in and they, they threw themselves into the line. 
So we were thinking, oh, wow, okay, we're, we're right in the front. We're going to get that car. There's going to be no issues because there's not a lot of people in front of us, you know, as they let us in. But five minutes before, as soon as it went from having like maybe four or four to six people in front of us, we literally had maybe 25 to 30 right when they opened up. And at that point, they couldn't really control it because there was just too many people. Yeah. Please don't be that person. Please. So the store opens up. And Mr. P goes... Hold on. So the store, before it opened up, the people from Toys R Us will come oh, yes. and give you a ticket right, for what you wanted. So I asked, and they told me there was only one of the cars that we wanted for girls. They had like four or five for boys. So the moment that they open up the store, everybody just starts rushing in. I'm making sure nobody's pushing my side of the family, right? And then... I asked, I had asked already where were the cars located. They told me they were in the front. So I ran to the front. I see all the boxes. None of them say what color if it's for boy or girl. None of them. So I'm like, hey, we camped out there a few hours to get this done. I put myself and barricaded all the cars. People were coming trying to push me out and I, I was screaming back at them. It was like, Go. <laughs> no, actually, that happened afterwards because the the so, the the associate there said, "Oh, they're they're all girls." No, because it wasn't just one. If I'm not mistaken, there was a. They said that there was a couple, and the sales associate there is like, "Oh, yeah, that one you have, that's the girl one." So as we're getting ready to pay, we're in line. Uh, Mr. P asks the cashier to open up the box so we can make sure that it was the Barbie, the girl one. So as they're opening it, guess what? It's not pink. It wasn't. It's blue. So then Mr. P runs out of line, goes in front of the remaining cars, and starts yelling, which one is the pink one? Which one is the <laughs> pink did. one? Tell home. me this was the pink car. Mind you, there were other people like grabbing stuff, and it was just it was just chaos. Yeah. I was taking stuff on people's hands. I'm like, no, I must see I was here first. I'm going to get what I wanted. So then uh, one of the workers there, they're like, oh, then we don't have any pink ones. And oh, then I went off. I went off on them. I went off on them when they told me, no, they didn't have any. And guess what happened? Guess what? They went in the back and they pulled the pink one. I think that mm. some of the uh, workers there wanted the pink ones and they kept them in the back. So they, they didn't bring them out because after complaining. Then suddenly you have. Mm -hmm. After everybody checked and they said, no, we don't have, we don't have, we don't have. I think after that, we didn't really do the whole Black Friday anymore. Just because mm -hmm. it was it's just too much. It was just too much chaos. Mm -hmm. People arguing, fighting, screaming. And here in Miami, no. There's no respect. Mm -hmm. So, at least we could say we did it once, right? We have yeah, an experience. We My mom, usually when she comes over for Thanksgiving, if we are, like once we're done eating... We sometimes head to the stores to see what they have left, but it's not like, oh, I need to go out there right now. This yeah, morning. we needed to be first in line. No. Mm -hmm. no. But I do, if I'm not mistaken, I I thought I saw that um, um there's a lot of stores that aren't going to be open for Thanksgiving. All right. Mm-hmm. I'll take my little boy's choking. Come here. Yeah, because of the pandemic. I did not just because of the pandemic, but they shouldn't be open on Thanksgiving Day either. It used to be Black Friday on Friday. Now it's I know they doing Black Friday, Friday online. That is well, for sure. We got to see what happens this year because people don't want crowds. Mm -mm. They want social distancing. Yeah, I think and that doesn't work when it comes to right. pushing, screaming, and trying to get the first thing online. Yeah, I think a lot of people are just going to order online. I mean, that's what we've been doing. Like Amazon Prime. <laughs> we literally have several boxes a week being delivered. Yeah. So with that being said, once again, hey, make sure you go ahead and check out my collab partner. Link in the description. We do hope you like like our video. So make sure to hit that like, subscribe, share us one time. That's all we ask for. And everything you want. Hey, you tell me what you want me to eat. I'm gonna try to eat it. Even if it's spicy, because I'm trying to conquer heat. As you saw the last video. 911 got me. You did good though. 911 got me. And if you know anything that's spicy that you like for my dad to try, just let us know in the comments. So with that being said, Bajanitas, out.